Hi everyone, in this episode of How Do You Do That, we're going to look at the title generators on the edit page in Resolve. So what we're going to do now is if we look at the edit page here, and on the toolbox area we have our video transition, audio transitions, generators, effects, and so forth. But then we also have an area here called titles. Now as you can see when I scroll through this I have certain title effects that have a little lightning bolt on the left. That indicates that this is actually being generated together with Fusion. And if you see the ones that are without the lightning bolt those are actually using the title generator within the edit page. So for example if I come over here and I just take a text area and just place that over the picture on the second track like so. And now I want to change the position of the title. I can just click on it and move it to wherever I want. And then go into the inspector and call it uh, Lion, for example. And then we can also stretch the text out if we want. Or I can also come over here and even widen it out if I want to like that and then I can move it to wherever I want it to be. Now over here in the inspector area it allows me to select whether it's left or right justified or center justified for example. I can change my drop shadows and strokes and backgrounds and everything like that here. Okay so that's actually using the um, internal title generator inside of the edit page. So now I want to have something that is just a little bit more ornate. So what I can do here is just delete that from my timeline. And then I want to use, I can use text plus or I can use these pre-built titles for me. So if I select 3D lower third shelf and I drag that into the area, I can then come over here. And then I can drag the length to the desired portion here. And now as you can see on the top here we have a little red bar. This indicates that this title has to be rendered. So now what I do here is if I click on this it will show me Fusion Title 3D Lower Third Shelf. And then I've got the main text components and we'll just call this Lion. Okay, and then I have the other functions for this, so color and specular intensity and everything like this will come through. Now once I render it, as you can see, now it shows up in the picture like so. And then, of course, it's going to, this part hasn't finished rendering, so it's going to be a little jerky at that point. And then I want it to go away at that point there. Now you see it's almost finished at that uh, portion. The part isn't done yet. And then it unbuilds itself and brings it down. Now if I want to see what Fusion did to this, I can actually click on the Fusion tab here and then once I come over here you can actually see the title generator that was created. So as you can see it's actually a grouped uh, title so if I want to look inside I can either click on expand group or I can just left mouse click on it and then bring it up this point this way and here I can actually see all the nodes that were used to create this particular title animation and then I can make any modifications if I want to. Okay so for more tips and tricks like this have a look at the other videos on our YouTube channel and for more information about training services have a look in the comments below. Thanks and have a great day!